afraid I haven't observed that. Uh, but, you know, if that's what you have observed, observe it and come to your conclusions. I put out a statement that's either true or false. But I started with the word apparently, meaning that's just apparent to Neely Fuller. Maybe other people can see other things, including white people who will hear me say that, white supremacists included, who will say, wait a minute, this guy is saying something absurd, and he's saying something that's absolutely not true. This is all about sexual liberation. This is all about sexual democracy. This is all about the foundation of what our uh, wonderful system is all about, the system of, of, of the free spirit, of freedom and justice and liberty. This is what this is all about. What is he talking about? Who is this crackpot, Neely Fuller, talking about this is some type of white supremacist conspiracy? And they can say that. And yes. they should say that if they believe that. And then the average person listening to both sides, like I always say, listening to all sides of every point of view, regardless of what the source is, listen to it. And then look at what's going on in front of you and come to your own conclusion. Listen this and is look. the whole essence mm -hmm. of the compensatory code. Look, in order to seek truth, don't take anybody's argument and run with it without examining it. And that includes Neely Fuller's, that includes the white supremacist view, that includes the white people who are not white supremacists, that includes all of the people of the planet. Just listen to a person's words and go check yourself. Go and take a look at what you see.